Okay, we are back with the Lamborghini. I promised you guys I was going to shoot at it and I'm going to keep my promise. But there's something I didn't tell you guys. My grandpa actually owns the world's only and first bulletproof Lamborghini. We're going to shoot at it. He is out of town. But with the help of Armor Max out of Utah, they volunteered to change the glass for me. Uh, we're going to shoot at it. It's supposed to be bulletproof. I don't know. We'll find out. And uh, my grandpa's out of town. He won't know. So by the time he gets back, we're going to try to get the glass changed. So he's not going to find out we shot at it. And uh, put it back in his garage. So Armor Max, Mark, thank you so much for uh, willing to change the glass for me. I really appreciate it. They're the ones that actually made the car bulletproof for us. So uh, we're going to go ahead and test to see if it's actually bulletproof or not. Jasper, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, let's get to it. Hey, cabron. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. You want to cover the paint or something? Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm going to have to cover the, like, the roof and the body because I can't have uh, any damages or chips off the uh, paint. So I'm going to I'm gonna come back and cover the, the hood and the roof with some plastic material so the fragments from the bullets are not going to hit the, uh, the body. Just Perry, can you help me with that? Yes. Let's go. There's our little rig. Hopefully uh, the fragments from any of the bullets are not going to hit the paint or the body so we don't have to take it to a body shop also. That will be a disaster. It'll cost thousands of thousands of thousands of dollars. For start, we're going to go with the 9mm. I'm going to skip the whole 22, go straight to the 9mm and I'm going to be using the MCK sent to us by CAA. It's a conversion kit that makes your turn your handgun into a little submachine gun. Just better give me a zoom on this. So I got my Glock 19 in here. So simply this opens like this. There's two little buttons here. You hit it, this slides out. There's my Glock 19. It's chambered nine millimeter. And then just for you to show this here, it slides in there like that, snaps in and just locks in. Very easy. They are very popular. I will put a link in the description, check them out. They are coming out with a clear version of this. They do have other colors also, but they're also gonna make the clear version. It's pretty cool. You can see your Glock inside. And they're also gonna make it for Glock 26 and I think 27 if I'm not mistaken, the subcompact Glocks. So check them out. Also comes with the, just pray, I'm not pointing at you. Just wanna show you the light right in the front. It's got Picatinny rail on the sides, on the top. They also have a red dot sights if you're interested, but uh, cool brace, it folds like that. And you can put it in your car very easily compactable. Opens like that. Just very ready. I'm ready. Like I said, nine millimeter, full metal jacket. Oh, where's that? There it is. Oh man, <laughs> I'm scared. I should stop a nine millimeter at least, right? Cabron, it's a bulletproof gla uh, glass. Woo! We think. All right. Well, bulletproof car, no glass. Yeah, the whole car is bulletproof. So we'll shoot. I'm gonna go over there. Ready? I'm ready. Fine. It might ricochet. Go back a little bit. I'm sorry. Fire in a hole. <laughs> it did ricochet. <laughs> okay. Ah! Dropped him. Okay. First shot. There's the lead. Thank God I put this uh, mat over here. The fragment came up and hit the... Uh, it cut open the mat. This is why I put the stuff here. So it hit the glass and nothing happened. It just maybe broke the first layer of the glass, little shatter in the middle, but that's about it. Right about now, you're probably sitting on your nice couch at home, wondering what kind of insurance does his grandpa have to be able to cover this kind of work? Well, if you're asking yourself that, you're asking the wrong question. What you should be asking yourself is, do I have a concealed carry insurance? If you answered no, then you need to consider getting one and USCCA offers real good deals. They will cover all your attorney fees, court costs, and among other stuff. You never know what you might run into in case you do end up in a situation like that. You always want to be protected and USCCA offers real good protection at really good cost. And here's the cool thing. You don't have to actually have a CCW to get yourself a concealed carry uh, insurance. As long as you have a legal weapon, they will insure you. So check them out. There will be a link in the description. You never know when you might need them. Okay. I'm going to jump from nine millimeter. Going to go straight to the 50 AE. No playing around. And I got the double desert Eagle gold ones from Magnum research. And it shoots those bad boys right in there. I hope you guys can see them. 50 AE. Ah, the problem is shooting two, aiming sometimes gets off. That's pretty. Oh, I am wearing this so the glass doesn't hit my face. FYI. You ready? I'm ready. Okay. Here we go. Lock and load. Woo! 
That's better. You want to go back a little bit so the glass doesn't hit you? Okay, you're good over there? I'm good. Okay. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. <laughs> Cabron. You want to do it? No, you do it. Okay. Woo. Hopefully it doesn't hit my body, the glass. Okay, here we go. Safeties are off. Fire in the hole. Check that out. It did not go through. You can see the lead right on the surface. Come on, where you grab and come back? Uh, he's coming back next month. Oh, okay. He's okay. in Europe. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah. We'll be good. We should have enough time. They can replace the glass. Yeah. Next round. Next is going to be a 500 Smith & Wesson. This is the gun that uh, Demolition Ranch and Kentucky Ballistic have a feud over. They have a bunch of drama going on recently. Why don't you shoot it? Show Kentucky Ballistic and Demolition Ranch what a little girls they are. Okay. Yeah, you come do okay, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They cry about this every time and they got drama going on like little... Hey, cabron, just please don't miss, okay? No, cabron. Go. <laughs> okay, ready? you ready? I'm ready. Uh, okay, go for it. Okay. <laughs> this is nothing. I know on. they cry about it 24 7. <laughs> there this, you go. This is my favorite guy. Scooter and uh, <laughs> Maddie Boy. There you have it. That's how it's done. There it is. The bullet did not. You know what? I should go inside the car so I can show them that nothing is going on. Okay, that's better. You hold on to the gun. Let me go inside the car. I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen the interior of Lamborghini, but this is how it looks. Okay. Let me show you guys the damage now. As you can see, nothing is smooth as the baby's butt. Nothing is coming out. Everything is looking good. Here's the inside. Everything looks good. You guys probably didn't think I was going to shoot it with the AK-47. You're totally wrong. We will stop at nothing. 762 by 39 AK round. That's very ready. I'm going to go two rounds. Just to prove you guys, my grandpa is legit. He doesn't BS when he says the car is bulletproof, it's bulletproof. If he says he brought an M16 from World War II, then that's what he did. He has a time machine. That's pretty. Go back a little bit. Okay, lock and load. You ready? I'm ready. Let me go back more. As you can see, all the damage is really surface damage over here. The bullet is still not going through. Let me double check on this one. It kind of looks like it went, but it also doesn't. No, we're good. We are 100% good. Okay, next round. Armor Max out of Utah. They make some of the best armored vehicles. If you guys remember, I shot um, one of the SUVs they sent over. And it was a really cool video. I'll put a link in the description. You guys check it out. Thanks to Mark out of Armor Max. He's always hooking it up. And this is some of the crazy stuff that they do. You ready, Just buddy? I'm ready. Okay, let's go. Okay, everyone's favor. My grandpa's car 98 German Mauser. My grandpa's service rifle from World War II and it shoots this eight millimeter Mauser. Italian car, German technology. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, now quiet for the action. This is the best sound ever. Jasper, you ready? I'm ready. There you go. Go back on this one. This is a big boy round. Oh, I can't believe. I don't know if it's rated for this kind of round. We'll find out. Mark, if this bullet goes through, you're gonna owe me a new Lamborghini for my grandpa. I. Zwei, drei. Woo! <laughs> ah, missed it. There it is, just ready. Give me a zoom in from over there. As you can see, it hit the surface. Nothing happened, maybe one layer of glass and all the lead got spread right over here. It peppered the top and it destroyed the rubber on the top, on the surface. Okay, it's also a car 98 proof. This keeps getting better and better. Next round. Next is gonna be Tavor X95, thanks to Gun Prime for sending this over to me. Gun Prime is always hooking us up. Check them out, gunprime.com. 
and we have a really cool new holographic site just better give me a zoom in on this one it's sent to us by vortex is their new amg uh1 gen 2 yeah it's a red dot holographic site the gen 2 one of the main upgrades on gen 2 i believe it's their um capability of uh, hooking up a night vision to it their previous model wasn't able to do it I will put a link for one of the uh, videos that gives you more full-blown detail on this. I'll come back to this in another video, but I just want to show you guys how cool it is. It even wait, looks wait, wait, cool. wait, wait, let me, let me zoom in, okay. Yeah, look how cool it looks on it. Wow. It works really awesome so far. I've been using it, no problems. Thanks to Vortex Optics for always hooking us up. Uh, oh, where's the round? 5.56. Five, and uh, we'll shoot the war. Loads up right here. IWI. Okay, that's pretty ready. I'm ready. Sides should be kind of on. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go here. Ready? I'm ready. Fire note. Okay, clear on this. Went right over here. No, wait. Was it this one or this one? I think it was this one, right? Uh, I think so. It did not go through. Anyway, none of them have been going through, long story short. It's been stopping all these rounds, which makes this glass one of the highest rated bulletproof glasses out there. This is what they use in a lot of their um, military application, government application for the front glass. And uh, it just so happened, my grandpa has it too on his Lamborghini. That's buddy. One last round and that's it, I promise. Okay. Okay. All right. My favorite M24 Remington 700 model. The upper was uh, sent to me by Gun Prime. The lower chassis is sent to me by Vox Chassis Systems. They make some of the most uh, beautiful chassis for your uh, rifles. This is a walnut stock. They have other options, different colors available. They also make really cool knives and axes. So check them out. There will be a link in the description for Vox. This does come with the M-Lock key rail on the sides and the bottom in case you want to add more stuff to it. Yeah, you guys can go ahead and laugh at me. I did put a close distance scope on this, sent to me by Vortex again. This is their newer Spitfire. I'm only shooting at uh, 10 yards, <laughs> 15 yards. So there's no need for a big uh, scope on this one. This was a perfect one and uh, man, such a beautiful gun, Vokes. I really love this one. Just Betty, you ready? I'm ready. This does shoot, of course, the 308 right there. Just Betty, you ready? I'm ready. Okay, back a little bit for this one. This is also a big boy round. Well, it, it kind of stopped. I should have shot this first and then moved on to the eight millimeter Mauser. This is a less powerful round, but you never know. We'll see what happens. Okay, folks, thank you for sending all this. Check them out. Final. <laughs> yeah, nothing happened. It got more glass everywhere. Just better. You're going to have to be super careful. We don't scratch the car when we clean it up. But uh, nothing is going on. Let me show the inside. Just better. I'll switch you a rifle for a camera. There is a the damage right over there. Nothing is going on on the inside. Thank you so much, Armor Max, for saving my life so my grandpa don't kill me. And here's the proof. No damages to the seats. The seats all look good. Okay, good. My grandma is not going to beat me up. Hopefully we can fix all this up before he gets back. Okay, thank you so much again to USCCA for hooking my grandpa and I with the insurance, carry insurance. Check them out, there'll be a link in the description. I'm also doing a giveaway. If you guys check them out, there'll be a link in the description. I'm giving away about 10 Amazon gift cards, $50 each. All you have to do is go to their website and check them out and uh, comment what you guys like. Also, thanks to Vox for sending the chassis and CAA for hooking it up with the conversion kit for that Glock 19. Just Petty, you wanna thank anybody else? Uh, you want to thank your cousins in Mexico? No, thank, thanks God. Thank God for us That's and uh, for me. And uh, thanks so oh, much. Wait, wait, wait. No, no. Thank Th you, Grandpa, cabrón. <laughs> thank you, my Grandpa. Grandpa. Grandpa, I'm so sorry I did this. Also, thank you so much to Armor Max for uh, 
willing to change the glass and at this point you're gonna comment and say well you didn't shoot the car that don't count that was only the glass if this video gets 100,000 likes I will come back and shoot the doors and we'll call it a day you should have some time before my grandpa gets back to get sent to a body shop also that's pretty is that fair enough 100,000 likes and we shoot the car yes okay fair enough I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up subscribe and as always thank you for watching we'll see you guys next time <laughs> grandpa so sorry I can't stop this guy you know that I tried, but nothing happened to the car. We fixed, okay? <laughs>